This is Nomax Image Lounge. This is an excellent alternative to Windows Photo Viewer. Now, why would you want an alternative to Windows Photo Viewer? Well, if you're on Windows 10, then you probably realize that it's kind of hidden out of the way. There is a program called Photos that comes with Windows 10, and that kind of now handles the sort of things that Windows Photo Viewer did. But I don't actually like it. I think it's a bit too sort of more like a phone app and um, I'm, I much prefer Windows Photo Viewer. Now you can get Windows Photo Viewer to work by messing about with the registry or um, group policy uh, options if you've got Windows 10 Pro. But this is a far easier way of doing it, just get another program. So I've got the installer package, I've got the x64 version. If you cl right click down here, you can't quite see it. If you right click on your Windows icon and go to system, that will tell you what version of uh, processor you've got most likely it's you're going to want the x64 version this is the installer this is the portable which means it will just run from a folder doesn't install anything anywhere else um, I'm using this x64 version and it's going to give me this .exe file here I'm just going to install it I've already got it installed but I'll reinstall it again anyway just so you can see how it goes doesn't install any bloatware or anything like that uh, I'm going to click finish and it will run it now you don't need to worry too much about this um, interface here because much like Windows Photo View, you'll just be double clicking on a file and it will open up. So I have a little folder of uh, pictures here. To make sure, like if I double click this, it's going to open with Nomax. Um, just to make sure that happens, right click and go to properties and it says what program it opens with here and you can click change and then from the list of programs you can choose what you want and it will normally also have a little tick box here which will say always open with this app something like that just make sure you do that for any images that you want to open with Nomax I'm, I'm calling it Nomax but it's Nomax Image Lounge anyway so this is much like Windows Photo Viewer I'm double clicking JPEG and the picture is coming up just like it would the good thing about Windows uh, <laughs> Nomax Image Lounge is you can use the left and right keys to go through all your pictures, which is exactly what I used to how I used to use it. You can use up and down to zoom in and out, so that kind of makes sense. If you prefer shortcuts, you can use Control One to view the image actual size, or you can go up here and use One One. You can rotate the pictures. It's basically Windows Photo Viewer. Now it does more than Windows Photo Viewer. It has quite a few cool options. You can save out images. You can edit them, you can crop them, you can do sort of other various things, but I actually don't tend to use any of that. All I wanted was an, a replacement for Windows Photo Viewer, and this is it. Works really good. It's actually cross platform as well, so if you have a Mac or, or Linux computer as well, then you might like to have a familiar interface. Without going on anymore, that's pretty much it. Just uh, download it and give it a go. It's a very good and very familiar uh, image viewer. And it's very small in file size too. <laughs> Hopefully this video has been useful to you. If it has, please give me a thumbs up. That kind of encourages me to do more videos. And subscribe if you'd like to see more of my videos. Thanks for watching.